but you are standing on so many hopes, wishes, prayers. North Huntsville is finally getting the store they've been wanting. I can promise you, this was not taking a chance. This was making an investment. Some kid will have their first job at Food City right here. Food City hosted two groundbreaking ceremonies earlier, making three stores to break ground in the city this past year. Councilman Devin Keefe says the addition of the one for North Huntsville can't be put into words. I can't even express it. What a moment. About a year and a half, two years ago, we started discussing our investments around food deserts, about bringing in new food and grocery store options for the city of Huntsville. And then through the works of about a year and a half of negotiations, the Food City uh, developers and the Bentley family, we found a location here in North Huntsville what will be a new grocery store that hasn't happened in decades. Mayor Battle also spoke on the significance of a store for North Huntsville. By doing this and by working with the Food City, there's going to be 200 people who have jobs out here who would not have had those jobs. There's going to be a, a lot of trade, a lot of uh, production. This is something that makes this community a special place. And uh, to Devin Keith, the one who has pushed us, he says, I need a food store. I need a food store. I need a food store. You got one. The addition of jobs is just one added benefit. So you want to diversify any job market. And the opportunities that, you know, your first grocery store job for a teenager, but as they stated, for elderly individuals who want to work a certain amount of part-time hours, and then you're diversifying what is offered here at the location. There'll be out parcels that will be sold off for potential food stores. There will also be a credit union here, Starbucks, which I'll probably be using a lot of. So this location does a number of things. A lot of birds with one stone. And there's more to come soon. You guys will be back here videotaping something very soon. Not only is Bob Wade dumping off at this location, but we'll be announcing some of the work that we're going to be doing across the street. Now, everything takes time. I want everybody to know they're not going to be able to build a food city in four days. But what they do build here will last forever and have an impact as well on generations to come. For Fox 54 News, I'm Ken McCoy.